Hi guys, today I'm here to show you how you can increase your battery life and also the UI smoothness on your Samsung Galaxy Grand. Okay, so on the left we have the iPad and on the right we have his little brother Samsung Galaxy Grand. Yay! Okay. <clears throat> So what do you guys think? Should I start making some videos on the gaming reviews for iPad as well? Tell me. Tell me in comments. What do you guys think? Should I try it? Anyways, let's keep this iPad aside and concentrate on our grind. Okay, first and foremost, I did some changes with my lock screen. Now, in my lock screen, I have the ink effect from Note 2 and if you guys can remember, this weather widget comes from Samsung Galaxy S4. Even the top status bar that invisible the transparent status bar anyways okay so okay so um I did some changes with my Galaxy Grand. Let me at first let me show you what are those. First of first and foremost, first and foremost, the lock screen. Second, this weather widget. Third, this top transparent status bar. It looks quite just like S3, uh, S4. What do you think? Anyways next I next now my grand has five row of icons five icons in one row even uh, in app tree also okay and uh, another thing is that A special smart feature added on my Galaxy Grand is in display and it's called smart rotation. Smart rotation disables auto screen rotation and uses the front camera to determine the orientation of your face and rotate the screen according. Okay. and lock screen in lock screen now I have ink effect in ink effect we have I have uh, lots of choices of colors red orange green brown blue navy purple black okay but I prefer the default blue one okay Okay, uh, that's some modification changes. Five icons in one row. Okay, now let me show you how. Let now let me show you how you can increase some battery life on your Galaxy Grand. So for that, okay. Uh, first, let me show you how you can increase the UI smoothness. Okay, uh, I don't have that app right now, but let me tell you how you can do it. Firstly, uh, the main battery eater on the stock ROM is the Ace Voice application. So, what you can do is just open Ace Voice and then go to settings, and from that, just untick and disable that 
home startup that option from home screen startup from home screen <clears throat> uh, which will stop that app he'll stop that it was application from running in background all the time okay second thing you can do for increasing the smoothness is going to developer option and in developer option and the developer come down here and says windows animation scale by default it's 1x just click this turn off animation off same for transition and the same for duration scale if you do this and I'm sure the UI will be much faster now and uh, this things available to all the users and it doesn't require any root access okay and if you have root access then some you can do some something more also some fancy stuff first you can install an app called greenify open the app and after opening the app here you can see a list of applications which i have added in the greenify okay okay so what greenify does is when you turn off the screen or when you log the screen some apps tend to run in the background and eventually it's a huge amount of processor and ram and thus resulting in battery loss okay so what greenify does is that when it turns on turns the screen off it hibernates some selected application and thus stopping them from running in background when the screen turns off <coughs> excuse me and uh, say watchdog I want to hibernate this application so what you do just tap here and press this right it's hibernating greenfield grand okay now it's hi hibernated okay so you know, this is the way you uh, another way you can save battery life is by installing an app called watchdog so what watchdog does is if any app started be start behaving it eats up start eating up uh, lots of ram and processor and thus resulting in battery eating up battery so you can install this application uh, what it does if if any app starts misbehaving in his in this so that application will show up here now you can see it says no application is misbehaving so once some application starts eating up some processor ram and thus resulting in battery loss you can just tap that application and kill it instantly okay it will save up your battery quite a lot and yeah <clears throat> and one more thing you can do is uh, delete some bloatware if you are rooted then you can delete bloatware from by going to root explorer and deleting some applications from system app, app folder app folder and uh, that's saving up quite a lot of ram and uh, let me tell you one thing i don't use any task killer or something like that i just use this android normal normal app cleaning tool or multitasking tool okay and uh, I've now now my phone is very very fast thanks to that this 
speeding up UI thing even it's quite a fast in power saving mode also as you can see it's very very fast in power saving mode as well guys I think if you try this it will help you and uh, it will somewhat help you help the battery life of your phone to increase some so just try it and uh, if you have any issue or problem you can just ask me in comments I'll be happy to help you anyways see ya take care bye